Yeah, yeah. So we were on the watch weight division, man. Just uh, any fighter in particular that's, that sticks out to you that's going to... I like I like all the fights. I mean, God, honest to God, truth, man, uh, I love what Earl Spence did. Uh, I mean, Lamont Peterson was, you know, definitely to me, you know... He faced him, so... Towards the, uh, the back end of his career, but he's always tough, man. It's a tough, tough dude, durable guy. But the thing is, is that I love the fact that, you know, how Earl Spence, how, how he's able to do it, man, how strong he is, how big he is, how dominant he is, man. And he continues to get better and better as, each time out. So I'm looking forward to Earl Spence uh, fighting against anybody in the division. Um, you got Keith Thurman, too, just coming back from, from, uh, from uh, you know, surgery, man. Give him some time. Give Keith Thurman some time. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, you know how he is. Give him some time. Like, as far as when I say you know how he is, yeah. you know, Keith Thurman's a dog. He, he loves to fight, and he wants to fight the best guys out there. Yeah. And the guy can punch. So, but give him time. Let him come back. You know what I'm saying? Get a couple little fights under his belt. Then fight a big fight. You know what I'm saying? The guy been out for over almost a year and something, a year and a half or so. Give him some time, man. You know what I'm saying? Don't put so much pressure on him. No, he will fight these guys, but just give him some time. Terrence Crawford, Terrence Crawford's in the division now. You know him very well. TC, TC in the division. You know, um, got to wait to see how TC look against Horn. Horn is a tough bully. Kid is strong. Kid comes to fight. Kid is awkward. You know, very awkwardly clever. So, you know, we got to see how how Terrence perform against a guy like that. If Terrence can handle a bully like that, then Terrence can handle a lot of these guys in the division as well. Because Terrence, Terrence style. He can deal with anything, man. You know, yeah. that's what makes him so damn good. He can deal with any style. And he can switch lefty and righty. And he knows ends and outs of the ring. He's very smart. Has he evolved since you brought him into camp and used him for sparring? Has oh, he's he really way changed better now. Old? He's way better now. I mean, when I sparred him before, he, you know what I'm saying? When I sparred him the first time, it was no joke. He whooped my, he whooped my ass the first time I sparred him. I ain't gonna lie, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, I was like, who the hell is this kid? You know yeah. what I'm saying? So, but I knew right away he was a different breed, a different quality, quality of, of a fighter, man. I knew he was A grade, prime, you know what I'm saying? Prime, prime grade meat so I was like man I'm like man who why are you not fighting you know yeah, why are you yeah. not fighting who, who, you know Cameron had him at that point I was trying to buy him out of his contract but anyways T Terrence is, is just he's uh his IQ level his seriousness and how, how serious he is uh, his skill set you know he's tall he's a little bit taller got like long arms he can box coming forward he can box moving backwards he can switch hit I mean there's a lot of things and he has power in both hands you know He's the only guy right now besides, uh, you know, uh, I want to say uh, not only Keith Thurman, but uh, the last guy I just mentioned, Earl Spence, that's knocking these guys out. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He's getting rid of these guys. Yeah. You know, he's the only guy in boxing, one of the few that are doing that.